Hello everyone, this is me, Sabia here, and I'm back with another reading, which is going to be all about your future spouse. Who is that person is going to be? How are you going to meet this person? Uh, when is that going to happen? You can find out all of that in this reading. We will also try to tap into the energy of your question with that person as well. So stick around and uh, just be mindful. It's a general reading. Hitman, it may not resonate with everyone out there. Pick whatever resonates and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's see. Who is that person going to be and what else can you get to know about this person? Um, let's pull out some more cards first. All about your future spouse. What can we get to know about them? find out who is that future spouse of yours and when are you going to meet this person and what else can you get to know about them Ooh, i could see the card that fell down which said faster than you think but let's find out with these cards first you are light you are magics you are epic external validation you your soul shines hmm this person is going to be like somebody who's going to add a lot of happiness to your life this person is going to make you realize how good you are of a person and uh, you are like so different, so unique that nobody can compare to you. This person is going to be somebody who's going to be like magic themselves as well. And they're going to walk into your life and make your life magical too. I feel like, you know, for some of you, you might mirror each other. Like, you know, the way they are going to be to you, you are going to feel the same way to them for them. Like, for instance, if they enter in your life and add so much of happiness, magic, abundance in your life, your soul would start shining with the love that they are offering. Same is going to happen with them as well. So you might be like a mirror soul to each other. But I really feel like, you know, this person is going to be adding a lot of um, magic in your life. This person is going to be somebody who's very successful as well. And I really feel like, you know, for some of you, this person has... Um, been getting a lot of uh, external validation for their success as well and they themselves are very down-to-earth kind of a person but at the same time as you get to know this person you are gonna get validated by other people regardless of whether you want that or not but you will be getting into recognition and all those things people are gonna make you feel like um you are somebody extraordinary as you are connected to this person i really feel like you know for some of you they can be a celebrity themselves social media star or something like that. They could be somebody who's very good at whatever they do for a living. But um, you are going to meet this person and it is going to be like an instant connection that you're going to share with them. It's going to be like you feel the same way for them. They feel the same way for you. So it's, it's going to be like you are going to marry each other is what I see here. Keys on a ring, many options. I feel like you know, for a majority of you, this person will have many options in their life. And maybe it's the same case with you. But even if it's not the same case for you, because I see that this person is going to be somebody who's very well-known or well-established or somebody who's like more like a celebrity figure, I really feel like you know, they will have many options to them. They would know that if they want, they can choose anybody. But at the same time, they are going to get drawn to you. They're going to see the magic in you, not the other people. So your soul is going to shine for them. To the point where they would not want anybody else but you. So I really see it to be something like that. When is that going to happen? When are you going to meet this person? In a few days time from now onwards, whenever you are checking this read, you are going to meet this person. And it is happening faster than you think. So again, I really feel like you meeting this person is going to happen in the next few probably days time. Like probably less than a week, less than a month time maximum i really see you meeting this person for some of you you might meet this person through your work for others of you you might meet them at a party or at an event or something like that um but yes you would have that thing like you know you would know that they would have many other choices many other people around them so you might meet this person in a place where there are so many people kind of like you know, wanting to be with them maybe at the airport maybe at the 
um, at the mall and something like, you know, where you would see a lot of people kind of like, you know, trying to get their attention, but they are getting their attention on you. So you would have that kind of connection with this person where even if they are going to be somebody who's very successful and everything, they would want only you and you. So I really feel like, you know, you're going to feel a sense of um, success uh, for yourself because you would feel like you are somebody that they want and um and there are so many people after them is what i see here so how your equation with that person is going to be i feel like you know, it's going to be love at first sight coming from this person here um love language physical touch i really feel like you know, there are going to be somebody who's very into uh you know uh physical intimacy would mean a lot to this person they would be very romantic is what i see here your connection with them is going to be very romantic i really feel like you know, this person is going to be like somebody who's very uh hot good looking uh strong body type whether they are like regardless of their gender but i really feel like you know, this person is going to be somebody who is uh you would feel like giving them a chance for sure i really feel like you know, they, because they would have so many uh, people interested in them you would have your concerns you would also find them kind of like you know slightly flirtatious i feel because you would feel like you know because they have other options they have other people why they want me so you would have some insecurities uh but Every sign that you're going to receive, every sign that you're going to get, you are going to be feeling that with every day, every passing moment, this person is going to make you realize that you are somebody that they want. It's not like, you know, um, they might be very good looking, which might also make you feel insecure. And the way they will have choices, options, um, that will kind of like, slightly um, make you fearful. Um, but they will be all yours. And I really feel like you know, this is something that... Um, I feel like you know for some of you they might have been like non-committal kind of a person before they met you uh and when they see you and they meet you they would feel like going for a strong serious relationship especially if you're not somebody who's going to be um uh, wanting to have a very um um if if you're not somebody who wants unconventional kind of a relationship um If, if you are somebody who is not into one night stands and stuff like that, I feel like you know, they would go any level to be with you or to have you in their life. So even if it's commitment that you ask for, they are going to give you that. Uh, for some of you, this person can have like a darker hair as compared to you or yourself. Maybe you are somebody who has a red hair or light hair, but this person would have a darker like a jet black or jet uh, like, uh, you know, a jet brown hair or something like that. But I really feel like you know, there is going to be a lot of attraction uh, that this person is going to feel towards you and they are themselves going to be very attractive. Let's see um, what else they're going to see in you or about you, which is going to draw them towards you. What else is going to make them kind of like, you know, get drawn to you? What else is it going to be? What is going to be like the reason why they're going to be drawn to you? What else is going to be the thing which is going to draw them towards you? I feel like you know, your your feet could be something very attractive to this person. Um for some of you, you might meet this person in a library or the taste that you have in books is something which is going to get them drawn to you. For some of you, it could be age 46. This person can be age 46, 42, 26. Uh, for some of you, you might meet this person at a hospital uh, while you're visiting for a checkup of yourself or the people that you're caring for. Uh, you might meet this person at a music concert. This person could be age 37 for some of you. Uh, but there is like, you know, um, a lot of colors that I see coming in your life with this person and bringing your life as well. For some of you, you might meet this person at a massage center. Um, I really feel like, you know, this person is going to be like uh, somebody who's going to draw to um, your your uh, beauty rituals that you carry because uh, that you do because I feel like you know, they're gonna find you very attractive very beautiful uh, they might see you very um, you know if you are masculine watching it they might love the way you are carrying that masculinity or if they if you are feminine they're gonna love the type of body that you have because they're gonna love the fact that you are somebody who's very um, you know um, careful about how you look and uh, you really are into something like that which is going to draw this person towards you. But I feel like, you know, for some of you, they're going to get attracted towards your hair color as well. For some of you, um, let's see what else they're going to love about you or going to find attractive in you. What are they going to love uh, about you? What are they going to love about you? <clears throat> what else are they going to love about you? They're also going to find you very uh, focused on things, um, walking towards something. They're going to find you like a person who has a goal and who wants to achieve it. 
um, this person would also find, uh, I feel like, you know, initially they might feel like you are somebody who's going to marry them for money if, if uh, you know, like probably anybody else uh, for some of you. But when they're going to get to, you know, try on you, you might not give it, give the, uh, I feel like, you know, they might have been meeting people in their life who are like, you know, ready to marry this person for their money. Uh, but when they meet you, they see you they they probably would not see you attracted to them as much as other people would be which is going to make this person get their attention towards you because they would feel like you are not even interested in them and like you know then there are people who are a bunch of people who are interested to kind of like you know get their attention so that might also be the reason why they're going to get drawn to you because you would be less interested in them uh so that is also going to be something which is going to draw this person towards you uh or their attention towards you i feel like you know this person would also love the way um you are somebody who's not like you know sending them any dirty offers that yet they might be receiving from other people i really feel like you know, there is going to be so much of uh, self-love that you probably carry uh which is going to make this person feel like you know they want you because you are not interested in them which might be the thing which is going to attract this person uh towards you more than anything else i feel like you know they would also see that you could be the perfect partner because they really don't like the people who are attracted towards them because of their money or fame and I really feel like, you know, for a majority of you, your future spouse could be somebody who's a very well-known person. And um, they already be getting a lot of offers coming from other people. And uh, they would not need them but you. So just, just know that. I feel like, you know, for some of you, yes, you would have your insecurities. But uh, you should not have, is what I see here. Because I really feel like, you know, the person is going to be, like, into you. Uh, and you don't have to worry about them any any anyways. So let's see what else are they gonna love you for? What else they're gonna get drawn to you for? Wow, I feel like you know, um, I feel like you know, you're gonna see you um, lost in your own world, which is going to again, it's something. I really see you meeting this person in a public place, and I really feel like you know that's where. You know where you are going to be the one who's going to be uninterested in them and the other people will be like craving for them or one look coming from them and their eyes are going to be set on you is what i see here so you are going to feel very um proud of the fact that no matter how many people out there want them they want you you would have insecurity in the beginning to be honest but as you get to know this person you would know that they are not like um other people they are you know somebody that you can trust and rely upon emotionally mentally physically and spiritually too i really feel like you know they are going to be very strong uh this person and you are going to be having a very uh, fearless kind of love i really feel like you will have a lot of opposition coming from people around this connection that you're going to have but this person and you are going to be very spiritual um together and i really feel like you, know, you are going to explore that side of each other as you get to know this person so yeah that's what i see coming through for you for this uh Read. If it was of help, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Till I do the next read, take care. Bye.